After seeing Air Force officials in the Cope North exercise with Japan service members on Anderson Air Force Base last week, it looks like the Navy has an exercise of their own with one key target, terrorism. Exercise Mariana Shield 2011 is in conjunction with a national exercise known as Solid Curtain Citadel Shield. It's the nation's largest anti-terrorism exercise that tests the skills of personnel on the Navy base. Incorporating hundreds of scenarios of lessons learned during incidents like the bombing of the USS Cole and the Fort Hood shooting, Joint Region Mariana's Training Readiness Officer Timothy Moon says the event determines the military's advantages and disadvantages. What well, gives us an opportunity to run through the policies and procedures, techniques and, and uh, tactics that we use in any type of force protection scenario it allows us to check those, make sure we're, we're doing them right and that we're getting to uh, a safe posture that we should be. In testing their vulnerabilities, Moon says this specific scenario timed the evacuation of personnel from a building that received a bomb threat. He says they also test the time it takes for the bomb squad, K-9 units, as well as other emergency responders to arrive on scene and secure the building. Each player is marked with a specific colored vest as they each play critical roles in the training event. Uh, the only challenge really is, is uh, the organizational piece, making sure that we get all the right players in the right place to conduct the exercise that has the most benefit for the, for the sailors and the Marines and the airmen that are, are conducting the exercise. Although this was the only scenario exercise officials were able to show us, Moon says there's much more they do in an effort to perfect their anti-terrorism force protection. Uh, throughout the exercise, we'll be practicing some events in the harbor to check our harbor security posture. We'll be checking the various uh, security postures at the gates, and we'll be checking also to uh, other, other facilities such as the Fleet and Family Support Center to make sure that uh, everybody just uh, aware and in, in tune with after the exercise, Moon says they will evaluate the performance of all the participants. Mariana Shield wraps up this Friday at 8 a.m. This is a great group of people here at the Naval, Naval Base Guam, and uh, we, we just uh, like to work with them all the time because they really like to work hard, and uh, uh, it's very beneficial for everyone. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Nick Delgado.